This tutorial is about mechanism inside the web crawlers that you all know search in the web using Google or Yahoo. Crawling is one underlying technique that derives search engine. Search in the web is a difficult task. Without search engine, we definitely not be able to use internet in a meaningful way. It help us in keeping track of information that we are interested in. There are underlying techniques derived search engines and crawling is one underlying technique when we want to search something in the web. What is a web crawler? It is a tool that helps in browsing the world wide web in a systematic automated manner. It also called ANS automatic indexers, bots, worms, web spider, web drawbo and web scutter. Before we come to the web crawlers, we start by talking about search engine. Search engine Search engine is a software program that helps in locating information stored on a computer system on the web. That means search engine is a software program. Whenever we want to find something, type in some phrase and search engine helps finding out the information that you need. Information stored on a computer system. That means information stored on some web servers which search engine will try to keep track of in some way and whenever user wants to search that kind of uh, information those particular documents or files would be written. In terms of how they are work there are two types of search engines called crawler based and human powered. When we are talking about crawler based search engine, there are two different functions that are building indexes of web pages and navigate the web automatically. Crawler based search engines creates their listings automatically. That means when the search engine wants to do some indexing, it will automatically try to find out what information available for that. It is not the situation. If you look for something called ABC, you can find out here. But in here, human is helping to find the dictionary. Web crawler is a tool that helps in solving the resource discovering problems in the World Wide Web. The main purpose of web crawler that is create copy of all visited pages for late, late processing by a search engine. It's called index or dictionary the downloaded pages to provide fast searches. Web crawler has two different functions that is building indexes of web pages and navigate the web automatically. Building indexes of web pages that means it has to go from one document to a next at any given time to looking at a particular document. Navigate the web automatically on demand. This is important because the web is changing continuously both in terms of size and lifetime of a web page.
indexes is basically mean of indexing is when user submit some search query it will automatically go one web server to other looking for that query information and based on whatever information it can find from there it will try to build up some kind of a dictionary called index in later user submit that query dictionary return results of the matches and if some pages updated next time crawler visit that web page newer version will considered and dictionary also be updated crawler based searches create listings automatically crawl or spider the web to create a directory of information can search through the directory a crawler crawl from one website to other usually crawling based on hyperlinks that are in one web page suppose a web page has four different links crawler will visit that four links according to the policies that decide visit which link to follow and not to follow simply crawler go from one site to other retrieve the information that has stored there after retrieve it stored index or catalog once stored there it will updated when some changes happen changes are updating periodically that means visiting of the regularly regularly means once a month and look for changes since last time visited a crawler visits a web page retrieve and follow hyperlinks visit the sites periodically periodically means once a month and look changes for example a book has an index if you want to look something you look index and find page number and straight away you can go to the page you want but there is no index it will very difficult to find what you want so the same thing happen here retrieving and indexing 